I absolutely love game soundtracks. I think there's so much amazing game music out there. Not a day goes by where I'm not working and listening to game music. And that's why I've been thinking about doing a little series that takes a look at some of the really cool moments in gaming that are tied to music. Games that take music and rather than just use them as a backdrop, they enhance the experience or tell the story in a very particular way. So we're going to kick things off today with Tiny Barbarian DX and its elevator ride. Tiny Barbarian DX came out on the Switch a while ago. Great game, by the way, if you haven't played it. Old school platformer, lots of action. You can elbow drop enemies. I mean, what more do you want? So you're this guy running around with a sword. You make it through some levels. You fight a boss, and this boss blows up the ground beneath you. You fall down into a cavern. You have to work your way out to the cavern, which eventually brings you to an elevator. And that's the particular moment I want to talk about with music, because the first time I heard it, it absolutely gave me goosebumps. As you start to play your way through this level, you realize that the music is representing what you're actually doing in the level, and it's also showing what happened to the character. So as I said, the character got knocked down, beat up, got sent to the bottom of a hole, and you have to climb your way out. So you're struggling to climb up, fighting against enemies. The music is rising with you. It's building. The notes are getting higher and higher. And then on top of that, like I said, that goes with the elevator, which is physically climbing you out of this hole and your character is fighting to climb his way up to get back to the bad guys and take them out. When you think about the song, you start to wonder, was the level made first and then the song was made to echo it, or was the song made first and it inspired the creation of the level? It's just the two are in such perfect harmony. It's absolutely beautiful. It's really engaging. It really pumps you up while you're playing. It just creates such a cool atmosphere for climbing your way out of this hole. One of my favorite moments of the whole song actually comes towards the end. You're climbing up the elevator, things are getting higher and higher, and then, well, I'll just let you hear what happens. Man, I love that moment where everything just bottoms out and you only have a few of the instruments still playing. It's got a little bit of a sinister feel to it, but it ties in with you climbing your way out of the hole and now it's like, okay, now I'm out to get the guy that sent me down here in the first place and we're going to take care of business. I just love the whole vibe of it. Man, I really think it's such a cool touch. I'm going to be doing a few more videos like this, not on Tiny Barbarian DX, that's my one moment in this game, but I've been writing a list of other games that have these special moments like this. Obviously, if you have one, if you have a game that makes you feel like this when it ties in music and gameplay in a certain way, let me know in the comments below and I'll check it out. Maybe it's something I agree with and already have planned to do, but I just love moments like this. I'm sure you guys have come across many of them and I'd love to hear more about them, so please let me know. Hey guys, RMC here from Go Nintendo. If you like what you saw in the video, why don't you give us a thumbs up and maybe even subscribe? We'd love to have you. If you want to see what else we're up to, you can check out GoNintendo.com for 24-hour Nintendo news. You can visit us on Facebook at Facebook.com slash GoNintendo. You can check us out on Twitter at Twitter.com slash GoNintendoTweet. And we're even over on Instagram at Instagram.com slash GoNintendo. I put all the links in the description just to make it easier for you guys to follow. Thanks a lot!